Yankee Poodle Yankee Poodle Yankee Sanky Hooray Tang to Tatty Yankee Poodle Yankee Poodle Yankee Sanky Hooray Tang to Tatty This past weekend, I had a chance to uh, do a photo shoot uh, with a friend of mine who rented a studio in downtown LA, um, hired two models, and um, because he and his girlfriend um, teach uh, photography classes, they invited um, some of their students uh, to come to a studio setting and uh, get a chance to uh, shoot models. Um, one of the things that I noticed uh, is uh, maybe because they're beginners or lack of experience, whatever you want to call it, uh, they were very shy uh, around uh, the models. And uh, some of the comments I've gotten, not that, like I'm an expert or anything, because I'm still very much uh, a student of photography, uh, but one of the comments I've gotten uh, more often than not is that um, people like the way I communicate and uh, interact uh, with models. So I thought I'd make a video uh, about what I do uh, when it comes to dealing and interacting with models. So, you know, it's just a few tips. First and foremost, the best thing you can do or the best tip I can give you is just to be friendly. There is nothing like meeting a new person, which is normally the case when you first hire a model, unless you've been working with them for a while, uh, to just encounter someone with a smile on your face and be welcoming and uh, right off the bat you're just setting it up that it's going to be a fun shoot. Um, when the model comes in, shake their hand, crack a few jokes, at least that's my style, and uh, just be friendly, be yourself. Uh, you'll see that they will drop their guard because they don't know what they're walking into. Um, and please, please don't be a creep. Um, so be welcoming, smile, be friendly. The second tip I can give you, and this is huge for, for some reason, uh, especially in a studio environment, bring some music. <laughs> Okay, there is nothing worse than, even as a photographer, uh, to just be standing there telling a, a, a model, hey, you know, uh, why don't you, you know, twist your shoulders or twist your hips and, or look over here, look over there. And as soon as you stop talking, there is nothing but silence. Okay, I'm not saying you know, bring a DJ or anything, but definitely do bring some of that party uh, atmosphere and, uh, you, you know, even if it's off your phone, uh, save a, a playlist or stream some music and also make it adequate. You know, you don't, you want upbeat music, music that'll make uh, somebody move. Uh, yes, yeah, a little bit like a party environment. Um, and that'll go a long way with uh, making people relaxed, whether it's photographers or, or models, and if you have uh, you know, a hairstylist or a makeup artist, everyone will just be a little more relaxed, a little more chill, just because you have that little ambient music, a little you know, uh, hip hop music or something with a beat. You know, it just, it, music like that just lends itself for uh, a good photo shoot. If you're outside, then that's different. You know, you'll have ambient noise, cars, water, birds, nature, whatever it is. But if you're in a studio setting, definitely bring some music. That's huge. Number three, and I think I've said it uh, at the beginning, don't be a creep. Uh, one of the things we tell our models uh, right off the bat is uh, we're going to ask them to pose. We're going to ask them uh, you know, to, to stand on one, one foot or, you know, whatever. Uh, but you also want to offer, Hey, uh, if at any point there's anything we're asking of you that you're just not comfortable with because of, I don't know, physical, uh, uh, 
limitations, um, you know, they have to feel comfortable being able to tell you that they're not comfortable doing that or uh, they're free to say no and you should be okay with that. Uh, so that's one of the few things we always tell our models. Number four, if you can, something I've done in the past is um, save out uh, Pinterest boards uh, with uh, photo ideas and poses that uh, I may be wanting to try during a photo shoot. Um, sometimes if you're having a hard time uh, verbalizing what it is uh, that you want to do or you want the model to do, uh, or the model is having a hard time figuring out what it is that you're describing, you know, showing a picture on your phone or on a laptop or a computer, you know, this is what I want you to do. It goes a long way. It's so much easier. And along with that, just try to be clear and concise. Um, you do the pose if, if you're able to, uh, if it's nothing crazy. Um, again, my photo shoots, my photo sessions have not been so crazy where, it, you know, I'm, I'm, the model can't do what I, I've been asking them to do. But again, uh, also be reasonable. Don't expect someone to just, you know, do a handstand and then let go with one hand or, uh, you know, do the splits or anything. Not everyone can do can do that. So uh, just be reasonable, be clear. Um, the whole point of a photo shoot, I believe, uh, at least in my experience, is you as a photographer and them as models, uh, male or female, um, you come together with the goal of creating great pictures. Um, as a photographer, if you accomplish that, at the end of the day, you go home, you download your pictures, uh, you open them up and you'll see, wow, uh, I really got what I was after. Uh, and the model nailed it. Um, and as models, I assume, uh, they wanna walk away uh, knowing that at some point after the photographer has had a chance to work on the picture, they'll have a cool image or a few cool images for their portfolio. That in its simplest form is why you collaborate. Um, I'm sure there's other reasons, but to me, that is the whole reason uh, to have a photo session. Uh, again, in the end, just be yourself, uh, let models be comfortable, let them feel comfortable. Um, one thing I always say, um, particularly this last time, uh, I made sure to tell uh, my models that it was a joy to work with them because it really was. Um, it was fun collaborating with them. Um, I told them that I really liked their attitude. I thought they were friendly and funny. Um, and that I would love to collaborate with them. And more often than not, uh, whether they mean it or not, uh, they told me that uh, they would be willing to collaborate with me again. And that tells me that I must have done something right. Also, obviously, uh, once they see the pictures, the result, um, if they're happy with them, then even more so, they would be willing to work with you again. Um, again, don't be a creep. Uh, be friendly, uh, make them laugh. That's something that I do maybe as a nervous tick or something. I just crack jokes left and right. Uh, I'm sarcastic. Um, uh, you know, one of my models uh, uh, showed up uh, a little late because of traffic, understandable, it's downtown LA. And as soon as she walked in, she's apologizing. She's saying, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so late. And the first thing that came out of my mouth without ever speaking to her, um, because I could tell, you know, the way she was apologizing that uh, uh, I think we would get along. Being sarcastic, I said, you are so fired. And she laughed, of course. I did not mean that. Um, but ob obviously have tact um, and um, just uh, have fun. I think everyone shows up there to just have a little fun and end up with uh, some great pictures. So. I hope some of these tips have been helpful. Um, if you're not great at them, uh, then just take one or two the next time you're uh, shooting somebody and, and just practice. Um, relax, be comfortable. Uh, people feed off of your energy. So if, if you're putting out there stress and uh, uh, 
anxiety, then uh, other people are going to feel that. But if you're comfortable, relaxed, and even enjoying yourself, I think other people will pick up on that. And uh, don't be afraid to make uh, mistakes. Um, if you tell a model to do a pose and you take a picture and it's not working, then just say, you know what, this isn't working. Uh, let's try something else. Uh, what's the big deal? If you make it a big deal, it'll become a big deal. Um, I don't think models expect you to be perfect with every single picture. Uh, just communicate and, and be honest. And uh, at the end of the day, I think you'll find you took better pictures than you think you did. And uh, just try and make it fun for everybody. All right, that's all I have to say about that. And uh, just get out there, take some pictures, have fun, be nice to your models. And uh, until next time, uh, peace. Money, peace.